Hello, my name is Jessie, and today I am going to show you the print feature in the LibKey Kiosk Management System. So what we're taking a look at right here is the public interface for LibKey. This can be displayed on a computer where your users can come in and make a reservation. Some libraries will actually display this on a beautiful big TV or display within their library so patrons and customers can see which computers are available in which locations. The great enhancement that's been brought now to LibKey is the print feature. So what this allows users to do is they can now log in and if you have this connected to your ILS this allows them to log in with that same username and password or of course you can create usernames and passwords for them. If you are using guest passes uh, you can do the same for that in your LibKey uh, administration section. So we'll log in here and now once we're logged in you'll notice we now have a printing tab. What this will do is this will give your user the opportunity to upload a PDF. Anything they'd like to print whether it's a Word document or some type of uh, file that they would like to bring in here and print at the library or wherever they're at that they have access to the libkey URL, this enables them to print. Um, if they do not have a PDF, um, let's say they're in a Word doc or they are in a Google Drive document, uh, they can export that to a PDF or you can use um, a PDF printer such as Qt PDF, um, which you'll see a hyperlink to. If I come over here, I can open that in a new tab and that will take me out where they can make that conversion um, or a web-based PDF converter. And that will again, allow me to just bring that file in. I can make it a PDF and then I can come over here and upload this. You'll notice over here on the right hand side, I have a browse button that will bring this up where I can come in. I can select the PDF that I would like to print select open and that will attach it to my system. The next step is we're going to select a printer. Now dependent on what options you set up in your libkey administration this will appear for your user. So again either color or black and white um, and then of course the option if you allow them to print front to back that will show us the duplex. So in this case I have a, a, a two-page document so I'm going to select that color printer duplex. From here I'm going to hit that upload button and then that will upload it into my system. Right here it's going to show me the funds that are available for printing. So that's the amount of um, money that I have available on my account so we can see that $2.90. As I scroll down here, it's going to show me now what is held or what is in my printing queue. So you can see here that it's showing me that I uploaded from the web. I want one copy. Um, there's two pages of it. I've selected my printer. If I want to come in here and change that at any time, maybe I want to go back to black and white, I can select that. It's showing me that my cost is 30 cents, so 15 cents per side. And again, that will be set up in the administration. From here, the user can come over and print, or they can hit cancel if you know they've uploaded something and they thought it was only 20 pages and it turns out to be 50, um, or they don't have enough money and they want to wait, come back another time to do it, they can cancel it. Once they hit that print button, um, this will give them a pop-up menu that shows them that the job will be released to the printer immediately. Are you sure you want to proceed? And then of course they can click that OK or cancel and that will send that up um, where the print job will be released for printing. Now, let's take a look at the administrative side of LibKey. So we're gonna come over here now to the administration portal. So this is where you would log in if you are a staff or a librarian that's working the desk and monitoring the information for LibKey. So again, we're gonna come over here. We're going to log into the system. And then this is going to show us our information. So if you're a current LibKey user, you're very familiar with the user's uh, management, the clients. Um, if you utilize the reservations feature, this is where you'll see that. Um, and now you'll see a fourth tab, which is print. Um, so you can see here our print manager, um, which shows us the pending status because it, it has been released to go to that printer. Um, I can see the printer it was sent to. The copy is the number of pages. Now. 
um, if there needs to be any type of management from the admin side, this is where users can come in and they can either print or refresh. Um, they can download it. Uh, so let's say the a patron or customer came up to you and asked a question, you could actually download it and then view that 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 file before it's sent off for printing. Um, you could do a quick view, which would show you that quick um, view of that option. Um, or of course, you could come back over here and then just cancel that. That will cancel the print job from the system. So this gives the, the librarian or the staff member the availability to come in and control all of that information. The final step is we're gonna come in here and just show you the print settings. So if I come up here to more, of course, and of course those settings, this is going to take me down where we can see our information. You'll notice on the left-hand side, we do have a tab for print management. Um, this is where the uh, Bywater Solutions staff will work with you to set up your printers. Um, you'll be able to come down and enter everything in from the type of printer uh, to the cost per page. Um, if we go up a little bit further, you'll be able to see that information so we can see what it is for each of the different printers within the system. Um, and then down below, of course, you'll be able to control um, if administrators can view and or print um, current jobs, uh, you can also set a timeout um, for how long it sits in that queue before it expires. We're really excited to show you LibKey print management and the newest enhancements to LibKey. Of course, if you have any other questions, you could reach out to Bywater Solutions um, or check the LibKey manual or documentation online in the GitHub repo. Have a great day.